guests, ladies and gentlemen. We gathered here today to commemorate the Korean War. 63 years ago, Communist North Korea launched its surprise attack across the 38th parallel guarded by the vulnerable Korean army. The bloody conflict lasted more than three years. This year marks the 60th anniversary of the Korean War Armistice. On the 27th of July, 60 years ago, the Korean War Armistice Agreement was signed at Panmunjom, Korea. But a peace treaty was never completed between South and North Korea. South and North Korea still technically remain in a state of war. Korea is the only divided country in the world. <coughs> During the Korean War, the United States made the greatest contribution and sacrifice to defend the Republic of Korea. 1.8 million troops took part in the Korean War. More than 36,000 American troops paid the supreme sacrifice. As the Greybeard, official magazine of the Korean War Veterans Association says, the Korean War is the America's forgotten victory because the United States defended the Republic of Korea against the attack from communist North Korea and because Korea, with the help of the United States, has become prosperous and developed the country. <coughs> For the past 60 years, the Korean people have worked hard to develop the country you defended with courage and sacrifice. Now, Korea is the world's 15th largest economy. Korea is the eighth largest trading nation. Also, Korea has grown to be a full-fledged democracy. As we commemorate the 60th anniversary of Korean War Armistice and also observe the 60th anniversary of the Korea-US Alliance, Korea is ready to repay the assistance and sacrifice it received during the Korean War to the international community. Together with the United States, Korea is actively addressing global challenges such as climate change and to promote energy security, humanitarian assistance, development assistance cooperation, counterterrorism, nuclear safety, and counter piracy. The Korean government and people are eternally grateful to Korean veterans for their services. We will not forget courage and sacrifice for freedom and peace in Korea. We will always remember and honor the legacy of the Korean war veterans who fought <coughs> the 